Hey guys and welcome back to this channel. In this video I'll be showing you guys how you can create this um, sort of awesome shake um, video transition on CapCut PC. So I'm just going to select my video, I'm just going to select this one and I'm going to split it in a few parts. For instance when she starts dancing I'm going to split it and then... oh okay not there sorry. My bad. Here. And then again here, and then again here, and then here. And I might adjust the speed a little bit for all of them. 0 0.6, 0 0.6. Actually, I'm going to add in the speed leader because it's going to be, we're going to use the curve speed instead. So we're just going to go to animation and add in a swing bottom video transition. Make it really like short, around 0 0.2 or 0 0.1 seconds, up to you. Again, I'm going to do it here and then also here and then here too. And then after that, I'm going to go to effects, video effects, and I'm going to go to basic and I'm going to add in a slanted blur um, effect to it. I'm just going to put it and at the beginning of the video but like of each video and then I'm going to make sure it's super short put the blur on 100 and the rotation at 50 I'm just going to copy and paste that to all of the other clips just kind of have it around the same size as your video um, animation like as the in animation that's what I meant and then you are going to add in this as a curve speed so go to speed and then go to curve and then select customize and this is what you're going to do you're going to put this up here I'm just going to delete some of it too. So I'm just going to delete these. And I'm going to put this one down here. Kind of like here. And this one up here again. And you're just going to do it for all of the videos. Make sure you select Smooth Slow Mo and choose Optical Flow for this one. Even though it's going to take longer to process, you do need to. Um, use that one. You can also adjust this later on. So I'm just going to again do that here. Select these and just delete them. Then you're going to want to put this up here. And then this one down here. Um, make sure your clips are a little bit longer than mine. Um, you can also add in slow motion before so your clips aren't as short. But that is kind of it for this tutorial. I hope it was sorry, I hope this was helpful for you guys. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and also subscribe to this channel if you haven't done that. If you have any questions, just leave it in the comment section down below and I will try my best to answer them all for you guys. If you found this video helpful, please click the thanks button above the description box down below. Thank you so much for watching. Bye!